Hello, I'm Natalie, and I'll be showing you how to make a touch sensor with your circuit playground. Now, you can use anything that can hold an electrical charge as your touch sensor, but metal objects are a really good choice. Here, I picked out a spoon. Now, all we have to do is connect the spoon to one of the touch sensitive pads. That's going to be A2, A3, A6, or A7. I'm going to use A3, and I'll just connect this to one end and connect the other end to the spoon. Once the spoon is connected, you can connect the circuit playground to your laptop and reset it. Now for the code for the touch center, we're going to go to inputs, select the first option, change button A to touch A3, change this to down, and then we'll go to light and set all pixels to red. Now to show the effect, we'll drag this over again, change it to touch A3, and up, and this time we'll set all pixels to blue. Then you can go ahead and download that code and upload it to your circuit playground. Alright, here I have the circuit playground with the code downloaded and the spoon connected. Let's test it out touch it, it's red, let go and it's blue. 